What's going on guys, Dragscope Designs here, and today I'm bringing you a tutorial on the basics of the pen tool. Um, before we get started, I just want to say thanks so much for 100 subscribers, it means so much to me. It is awesome how I reached this in literally a month. I barely posted a video like last week thanking you guys for 50 subs, what is it? I posted it 6 days ago. That I got 50 subs and I gave away my GFX pack. Six In six days, I gained 50 subs. And I joined August 9th and now it's September 15th. That is just completely insane. And like all of you guys is just crazy. I just want to thank you all so much. Alright, so let's begin with this tutorial. If you guys don't know by now, the pen tool is right here. What most people were to, were to do is either use the uh, magic wand, and they can just capture and just use this. But the pen tool is a greater tool to be using because you can get a more precise looking image. Or a uh, more precise area selected. So, um... Let's get started here by uh, going ahead and open up my pencil. I'll go use my navigator. I'm just going to zoom in and uh, start off here. So, basically, what I'm going to do is just show you guys the basics of what you guys can do. So let's just start off my point here. Drag it on down, hit that angle here. Alright, so now you have to see a little bit of a rigid edge. What you could do is a lot simpler, is just click the major points of it or what you could do is just basically just keep clicking across so let's see here alright so as you can see there's a nice little curve here instead of getting the uh, rough looking image of just clicking over and over again what you could do is actually get the other nit point click it and then drag and then position it to where you want it to be. So I'm saying about right here. And then what really annoys people is this annoyed me too when I didn't know how to use the pen tool. Is that if you click again, let's say our next point would be here, you're going to get these weird looking curves. So if I were to undo that, and maybe if the next curve was here, you get a weird looking curve. So what I'm going to do now is just click uh, Alt and then hit the middle box. That's going to tell your pen tool that you're going to make a new angle. So as you can see there, now we can hit another straight. We can just turn it there. Click and then drag. As you can see, this the pen tool is a lot more easier now that you actually know how to use it. For bigger angles, you just have to pretty much just play around with it. Get used to how to uh, direct and move the pen tool. And just, you know, have fun with it. Find some images you guys can use. Uh, the Apple logo is pretty fun to use. That's a good way to practice the pen tool if you need to. But uh, I'm using this one because it has good uh, angles and curves to it. Bad. <laughs> Alright, so basically that's pretty much how you use the pen tool. It's a really good design for uh, scaling models and stuff like that. Now, say you want to use the pen tool once you finish scaling. What I'm going to do is just finish up the layer by clicking the last uh, dot. So once you finally have what you need, go back to the first dot and click it again. So all the points that you made should be gone. What you can do now is just right click on the layer and click make selection. This will allow you to customize where you want the uh, layer you've selected. So now I can just go ahead and cut it off. 
if I want I can do this and then just do layer via cut and then I can just delete that there we go so those are the basics of the pen tool and uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial don't forget to subscribe for this for uh, some more tutorials on Photoshop and I actually might be uploading some Cinema 4D tutorials soon I got a request on how to make the materials I might be doing that soon um, thanks again so much you guys for 100 subscribers I really do appreciate it don't forget to like this video subscribe if this shit helped you and check me out on uh, Xbox you guys can add me there alien drag I'm starting up a new clan uh, we don't have any videos yet because we need some more editors and players uh, if you have an HD PVR and you want to try out for our clan hit me up on here or you can add me on Skype which you can find on my profile thanks for watching you guys Peace.